power is the problem in the problem where it doesn't allow us to be, do, feel, have what we want, where it restricts us, where it constricts us. All restriction and constriction is where problems begin. So here is the journey of the pain. And why do you need to know the journey of pain? Because when you start releasing pain, you will walk backwards into the journey, into the time where you were absolutely fine and fit. Whatever this restriction is, and restriction can begin with anything. Restriction can begin with a parent saying, what are you thinking? You can't buy a motorbike. Or what are you thinking? You're a girl. You can't go to another country and do your education on yourself. How will you manage? You have to stay at home. You have to get married. Of course, this is so culturally oriented. But wherever that restriction began, okay? so this is the energy, right? This is energy. All of this is energy, right? This is free flowing, everything. It is contained now in this computer. It is contained now uh, in this bracelet. It is contained in my clothes. It's contained in my body. This containment begins with restriction inside us, right? We get restricted, we get restricted, we get restricted, we get restricted, we get restricted. Then we start getting agitated. In that agitation, we start getting annoyed. We start getting irritated. We start getting frustrated. But this person, well, this person is part of our environment. We don't know what to do. We start getting anxious. We start getting fearful. We start getting demanding. We start getting controlling. We start getting manipulating because we all want what we want. And we will all try and find ways to get what we want. One of the biggest reasons for pain is that your needs haven't been met. You wanted that motorbike, hasn't come. You've instead been told you can't have it. So this restriction, 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 getting stuck, getting blocked, getting blockages, getting blockages, getting blockages, that anger, that fear, that hopelessness, that desperation, that stiffness, soreness, heaviness, achiness, painfulness, illness, disease. It takes a very long time to become ill. All of this has been going on over years before you have reached where you have reached. And therefore, when you uncover, you will have days when you will feel low, when you will feel down, when you will feel hopeless, when you will feel angry and raging and hateful, and when you will have days of anxiety and panic. And you will have days of agitation, but agitation will tell you that you're getting closer because the first symptom of restriction is agitation and restlessness. It's a good thing. And then finally, you will come here. This reverse order, sorry. Cheers, everybody. Let's do this. This reverse order is important to keep in mind because even though the decrees are the fastest modality in the world, meaning that where it would have taken you 10 years now to do this reversal, it will take you lesser, not even five years, not even three years. It will take you lesser time, but time it will take. And the way that you allow yourself that patience of healing can only happen when you have the shocking solution of silence. Only silence will bring you patience. Only silence will allow this. Not to mention that silence will also speed up all of your movement. 